Alrighty, guys. Hello and welcome. It is 5:35 p.m. here in Japan on Friday the 15th. This is day six of the sumo, and uh, we I'm going to get four matches in today because I guess I got home a little earlier, and maybe they're running a little later. So we will have all three Ozeki matches like normal for a weekday, but we're also going to have this match between Sekewake, Kotonowaka, and Homosubi Nishkigi. And what makes this one fun for Friday is they're both at a record of three wins and two losses. So, uh, yeah, it's a you know big match, I think, for both of them to keep going toward getting their eight. And uh, one will go to three and three, and the other one will go up to four and two. Uh, Tamawashi has Takakesho, then Kirishima has Shodai, and the final match of the day is a pretty big one, although both men are underperforming, I would say, this Basho, and that's Hoshoru versus Asanoyama. So that'll be the final match of the day. In that final match of the day is where you'll find all the links. Uh, links to the uh, contest page, you know, the public standings. Uh, links to anything else that you might need. My old channel archive, if you want to watch old sumo matches. Uh, the merch store. And uh, if you want to join as a channel membership or go to PayPal and throw a tip my way. All that kind of stuff. Final match of the day. All right, as we get ready, I think these guys are going to throw salt one more time. Or are we ready? Here's uh, Kirishima coming out. I was about to say Wakamoto Haru, but he's already fought today. He fought Tobizaru in another Seke Wake versus Komosubi matchup. And Wakamoto Haru was the winner. He uh, goes to 4 and 2. Tobizaru is at 3 and 3, so exactly the same parameters as this match, really. Both men at 3 and 2. And uh, Kirishima's at 3 and 2. He obviously wants to keep winning to erase that Kadoban status. And Takakesho is the only Sanyaku wrestler who was on the leaderboard with only one loss. So we'll see if he can maintain that here today. And probably in the next video, I'll scroll down and tell you who else maintained their one loss record from earlier in the day. Um, but I was gonna say, uh, tomorrow full coverage, Sunday full coverage, Monday full coverage, because Monday's a national holiday in Japan, no school for me. Somebody asked in the comments, uh, well, okay, there's two things that people are talking about. One is, where's Nato? Where, where can I go get highlights? Jason, you're only putting up three matches. We appreciate it, but we want to watch more. I get that. Nato is getting struck daily by NHK. So he's playing a cat and mouse game. I don't really know why he bothers anymore. He's also over on a website called Rumble, R-U-M-B-L-E, uh, which you can go try to find his stuff over there. And if you follow him on Twitter, he often puts up links to his... Like right now, his channel is called like Justin Bieber Wrestling or something crazy. So uh, follow him on Twitter if you want to find out where his highlights are. Okay, here we go. All right, so in the box down, of course, that's former Yokozuna Kakiru, now a coach in Oyakata, um, giving some play by play on the Abema channel today. So, you know, this is kind of boring sumo, right? When only one uh, wrestler sort of shows up for the match. Nishkigi just didn't uh, offer anything in the way of resistance or strategy or anything in that match. It was all Kotonowaka. So he definitely deserves the win. Go to 4-2. and two. Nishkigi has got to rethink, what was I doing in this match today? It's just nothing. Uh, and, you know, if that happens, I get it. But uh, makes for pretty boring sumo for the fans. Uh, Nishikigi now at three and three, but doing you know way worse than that is Tamawashi coming up, and he is zero and five as he faces Takakesho today, and so come on back to the next video for that match. See you there.